theater. We redid the old city theater. And we have uh, 516 seats and it is beautiful. Season one is cool, but I want to tell you, we just released, they're about to release this tomorrow, so you get the first word. This calls for glasses. <laughs> <laughs> the season kicks off, season two, August 26th, Dolly Parton. <laughs> September, Dorothy Moore, John Anderson, showing the film, The Mark of Zorro. The Philly Hillbilly Rockin' Roundup featuring Junior Brown. That's Marty Stewart's 65th <laughs> birthday celebration. <laughs> Kershaw and Rockabilly concert. The Ham Peace, Love, and Ham Jam Weekend is Marty Stewart's Fabulous Supremacist, Roger McGuinn, Herman's Hermits, <laughs> American Patchwork, and uh, Ashley McBride with ISIS. Jazz at Lincoln Center featuring Wynton Marcellus, Steve Miller Payton. Library of Congress presents the Classic Film Festival Weekend, Mississippi Mass Choir, Winona, Turner Classic Movies was coming back to town, uh, Chapel Heart. They got to have Mardi Gras Festival. And uh, great on Valentine's Day, Graceland presents a Valentine's Date with Elvis, an Elvis movie. That's gonna be cool, the Mavericks. Uh, uh, Delma Green Band, <laughs> Merle Haggard's 87th birthday celebration, an evening song, an evening of songs, Haggard Stories and Songs, hosted by country music legend Connie Smith, accompanied by Eddie Lane, the special guest Marty Stewart, the Spanish Superlatives, and Cinco de Mayo in May is a Manuel fashion show. <laughs> Go on uh, Congress of Country Music and to see all about it. And so come be our guest. And we'll get into building the museum and all that stuff starting at the end of this year. So Congress of Country Music, that's right here. And in the lobby, I was told to mention the Case Knives Company donated a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Congress of Country Music set of Case Knives. Wow. A once in a lifetime kind of thing. There's some prints out there. The photographs that I took, and so the silent auction, I think it closes at 11 o'clock. So all that goes to help build the Congress of Country Music, and that's 